I don't go to the police. Because at the end of the day, enough man go to the police and still end up dead. Exactly. Sometimes all the same police, them too. Family did genuine, no key and go murder able then. Envious of crosses. You know, what as I inform and get to know you. Love to use them out, music right to let you fall up. Mama she a ball and scream, them kill my friend in front of me, I know me a scared it. Family did genuine, no key and go murder able then. Envious of crosses. You know, Hi, welcome back to SoFlow TV again, everybody. It is your host with the most. I want you to listen. I'm mean, why you listen carefully. Go ahead and smash up that subscribe button and hit the thumbs up and get this video out there. All right, listen. So we covered this whole Silk Boss something before. And I said, if Silk Boss is not willing to go to the police, make a formal report, file a complaint, Tell the names of the people who did that to him, assaulted him, then this is a publicity stunt. Hmm. I think I spoke too early, you know. Check it. Silk Boss knows who did this to him, right? So it makes sense that if you are a person who you're, you, you want to live on the legal side of the law, then. You know, in a nothing with no gunman, no bad man. Then if people violate you, you are a law abiding tax paying citizen. You pay police salary, so you use the police as your security force and you tell them who did that to you. However, I'm starting to learn the dynamics of this whole silk bar something. I catch one video where I see a youth talk about silk boss as being the only artist from Mobe who forward got town and get box up and take disrespect and it had something to do with silk boss being around people he's not familiar with and leaving behind the people that he came up with so the man them take it a certain way we did that if you from you did that nobody dog we did that try the road with you brother i know y'all get somewhere you just cut me off and gone with a bag of new man a bag of new man that don't respect you a bag of new man that you don't really know probably them don't even have good intentions for you but we're gonna violate you because since you turn your back we like that when you start eat a food after we give you all the strength, then you are with enemy now. Them situations that do happen, right? The whole talk about some done that control a certain area where silk where make silk bars get violated and all these things. Listen, me not in none of them details there. What I'm more focused on at this point now is watching the interview because when we see so him go do a sit down interview with Winfred Williams on on stage. Me said to myself, say, okay, this is the point of reveal because you can't really hide. You see, I'm a good person of discernment. Me watch closely, pay attention to body language, mannerisms, and delivery. You hear me just say? Body language, mannerisms, and delivery. Bria, in the interview, which is his woman, she was saying, well, call her a manager slash woman, woman slash manager. She was saying stuff that, um, you know, she had talked the talk. She had talked the talk. And she's trying to make the, watch the interview with on stage and watch Bria's body language. She is very boomy. She's trying to remain composed. She knows that shit just got real. She knows the shit has hit the fan. But you know when you have to talk like you're strong. And she said that. You can't make the internet and the world say you, you, you have a weak moment. You know, you're scared right now. You have to put on a brave face and go forward. And that she's doing. Silk Boss talking about me no care. Mr. Winford, listen to me. Me no care. That's a cry for help, my friend. 
every rotted body care. No man out there no no care. Everybody care. Okay? Especially when you know say your life is in danger. Read between the lines of what Silk Boss said. When the man said him shame tree done or him shame tree bundung. In other words, in our culture, if you take box up in a corner, it can make you ashamed because people are going to laugh after you and say exactly what I said on my Morning Thoughts show about Silk Boss. I say, you out there make bad man song about running a people yard and do this and, you know, you're a bad man in your song them. And then people catch you and box you up on camera out of road and you never do nothing about it. You see, ego, ego is a hell of a thing. And Silk Boss is wise. The youth there, after watching the Winford Williams interview, me get a new respect for youth because him wise beyond him years, believe it or not. You know, when we are forward from certain environments, you know, certain ghetto and them thing there, when we are forward from certain circles, I know everybody are going to make it out. Pay attention to the underlying details in the interview. The man spoke of ego. And him said, if I did feel ego, a lot of people are say, oh, whoa, if I did me. This is social media. People in them comment section, everybody in them comment section for social media. Them rich in a real life. Them a bad man in a real life. Them can mash up anybody in a real life. But Silk Bar say, if I did you in the same situation, you probably would have dead. Why? Because you are going to tell yourself that nobody can box me up. And then you find yourself in another situation there. And you try different a thing. Instead of humble yourself. Swallow your pride. And beg for your life. And walk away alive to fight another day. You are going to tell yourself. So you are going to fight the man them. And the man them are going to drop a knife in your neck side. Or bust a gunshot in your forehead. Or something like that. See? So him live to fight another day. Because him shame tree dead, him not have nothing to be shame about. His ego did not get the best of him. So he was able to walk away. You see, from the youth said that, me say, yo, he might think different. He might pre more mature. I may respect that. See? Then him talk about being able to make it out. And him talk about how him not care. And if it wasn't for him mummy and him baby on the way, him baby mother, which seemed to be a surprise to Winford because um Bria don't look like she pregnant. The girl who him there with the manager, she don't look like she pregnant. And there was no official announcement of her being pregnant carrying a baby. So that's why... You see Winford look kind of surprised when I say, you know, she's carrying a baby, right? The baby she's carrying right now, that's why I refer to her as baby mother. Uh, she's, them just move over it and say, yes, it wasn't no big announcement. We're expecting a child. Child is on the way. But watch the man pre again. The man said he wants to be here to see his child. No other picnic out the him. Him did a gelding before that. If you know who is not Jamaican who don't understand what gelding mean, it means you don't have no picnic. Yeah, you might have get crutches, but you don't have no youth. So this I'm first one. And him young. And him want there if you see him youth live. Him want there here if you see him youth. Youth. When him said that part there. It's, a, it's one thing for say, yeah, my girl, I breathe on. I want to make sure I'm there if you see me pick me born. But when you talk about to see your youth, youth, that means you know, depend on foolishness. You are here for longevity in life. That means say you want they here for substantiate yourself in life to a point where you give your children them a good life and be around long enough to not only see them, but to see them grow up. We have picnic, so you have grand picnic and see your grand picnic them. And ego will kill that and make you get killed. That interview was very deep. 
Here's the deepest part of the interview now on, on stage with Silk Boss. You see the part where Silk Boss say, hmm. Remember, I know me tell you now, me say, listen, if him now make a police report and he's not saying who did it because him know who do it, then this is a publicity stunt. But we have to remember something. Silk Boss come from the generation we are snitching. Man, we kill you for snitching. And this new generation has snitching frigged up, twisted. Them don't know what snitching is. If me and you do a crime together, and me tell pa you because me get catch and not you, that's snitching. If you are my brethren and you violate me in a damn manner there, that's not snitching if me tell. But they don't look at it like that. You understand? From you go talk to police, police get involved and start hunt down man with case. They might go call that snitching. So in a slip boss mind, he's not snitching. He's not tell police nothing. He's not going to the police. Here's the biggest part now. When the youth say, I don't trust nobody, Mr. Winford, not even the police, because goodly all them police there. In other words, like him would have said, if him go make a complaint to the police, the police who him go complain to could be friends with the people them who violate him. So in other words then, it now go go nowhere. A man can lose them life back at that. That's funny because we've been talking about that on so, um, SoFlow TV for a while now. How the citizens of Jamaica don't have nobody to turn to. Because law enforcement officials are in corruption deeply. I don't know say Donnelly Donaldson. I don't know say I want police. I don't think of the first case that. I don't know say a lot of citizens have come forward. If you talk about how them get violated by police. After them go complain to police. On behalf of bad man and police friend. So in other words then. He want to complain. He knows his life is in danger. Him feel fearful. But one way to get yourself to not feel fearful anymore. Is to say I don't care. I don't business. And to put up a front. But honestly. Him know say. Things not good right now. Him know. You can tell say silk boss no. Remember you know. When Joshy did his ER interview. See. I like the part on the um, on stage interview here. Where. Winford asked him at the last minute. I'm glad Winford never asked him earlier because I wouldn't want that to take up most of the interview. Everybody knows say he's been going at Joshy lyrically. And me did I try to figure out why because I never know. Me don't know who started and all this. But from me see, I can our record cover make with Joshy with panty pan him head and a gun to him head. I say, yeah, the thing real. But Mr. Winford asked him last minute if him and Joshy at ends and all that. And the only thing him said about it was, tell him to stop calling my name. Tell him to stop calling my name, me stop calling Phoebe name. Alright, respect that. But remember when Joshy did his ER interview and Joshy said, about the police them, you remember that? And everybody said, blood cleat, yo, the youth. Say, boy, you have to go protect him now, you know, because police will kill him out there, you know, because hear what him say. He might expose the police, them, you know. Just say, the police, them, don't have station a cause crime, my friend. And them out there do things. And again, in Jamaica, it's been a long standing talk that a lot of murders are unsolved because of who is doing it. Remember, you know, when murder take place, a police have to go investigate or go on, you know. 
But if I meet a police and me commit the murder and then I me I figure investigate me, you expect something to come out of that? Eh? So somehow we have to understand how the system run. So we have to understand how the place run. And those who are out of it, outside looking in, can you not live in it? You can't say anything where you want to say. But when me watch it pre, and Silk Boss say, the part about the police, them, him not trusting even them. Me say, yeah, this wasn't no publicity stunt, this was real. Now, in closing this video, because I don't only talk about problem, I talk about solution. I don't want to know no in depth details about who did what to who. I don't need to unmask them youth there and see them face and none of that. I genuinely see that youth are in a trouble. I see some people say pray for silk boss and cover him in, under your blood, Jesus, and all this. Boy, enough people are Jamaica catch gunshot here and we thought they were covered under the blood and all these things. Prayers don't go work, yes, sir. Not without works. You see that video there? That video can serve. Forget police. That video can serve as an escape. If them smart, them use that video as an escape. And seek asylum. You see, the next time you book, if you go anywhere, Canada, the US, line up some immigration thing. I make you people them know say so you fear for your life in the country where you come from. And leg of the place for a while. And elevate from outside when you see alkaline. This is something that I wish my favorite artist Vibes Cartel had done. Leg of Rascal at Jamaica for a while. And go elevate overseas when you see Mavado. Eh? The money I proof say you can do it from outside. Cranium. Quite a few artists Lego Jamaica, you know. Them not live there, you know. It only look like so them live there, you know, cause them fly in when a time for the business and fly the ras right back out, you know. And that is what Sil Silk Boss will have to do. Sadly, when you're chosen, cause him chosen. Destiny choose him. A whole heap of youth come from which part him come from. We have DJ talent. I'm a rate the youth because me listen to him speak. And he said something again. Another gem that he dropped. Silk Boss might not be eloquent in him speech. Where he has mastered the Queen's English. But listen to what I say. He is eloquent in his thoughts. Zane. The man say. Everybody could have get the same break, right? Because the whole are we born with talent, or enough are we born with talent, but who are going to put in the work? And some man no want to put in no work. Some man no want to hurt. Some man no want to get up 4 o'clock in the morning when time peeing the wall is still a make nice out the door and it dark out there. Some man no want to guard them bed early so them can wake up early and go up on the grind. Some man want to brawl and party all night and sleep out the whole day. Wake up late and rub out ganja in a hand me gland, high and drunk from early. And now have no discipline to them thing. So of course they're not going to make it. There's a saying out there that says, Preparation and hard work. Consistency will beat talent every time. Wanna hear that? Preparation, hard work and consistency will be talent every friggin' time. Meaning you can be the most talented person in the circle. But you see a little bridging. When make himself prepared. And is consistent with putting in the work. He going to rise to the top. Be the cream of the crop. And you are going to look upon him and say, but how he make it and me more talented than him. You're never willing to put in the work, brother. That's some of the stuff that was said in the interview. On, on stage, Silk Boss is very aware of his position in this place here. Yeah. Take that video there. Show it to some immigration officials. It's out there now. It was made to humiliate me. 
they're after my life i am no i'm safe nowhere on the island me can't afford to always a walk around with security because all the money me i earn would be used to pay for security to secure my life i couldn't even open a proper case with law enforcement because law enforcement is in corruption within my country i feel safer over here so they are gonna kill me if me go back the only time them man never see her when you forward to do a big show like Alkali. You know, see when Alkali forward, him forward with 100 police around him. And then he might command them and he might make them know, say, yo, uh, yeah. Maybe I forgot to do that, my youth. But yeah, me take back my talk. It's not a publicity stunt. This is real. Some people are going to say in the comment section while I close this video out. Yeah, but if him, if people can't catch him, then we catch him mother. Boy. Maybe he must have got deal with that too. Move out the family. But you can't save anybody when you can't save yourself first. So first order of things is get yourself up out of there. And then situate your family properly. Focus on your talent, build songs, put out video, be consistent, link with the right people, Lego the dirty vibes, and Lego some dirty boy from around you, because some of them now are no progress. If you're in a music, my youth, if you're pre music, nobody with no bad man company. Sometimes because of where you're forward from, you feel like the bad man company can save you. But me see somebody said this yesterday. I'm going to leave it right as upon a video here. Anytime you're par with gunman, dirt is not far. I'll catch you all on the next video with SoFlow TV. I'm out. Peace. Um, me show you up. Me show you up. Come here. Come here. All right, my SoFlo TV audience, let me promote Wifey's channel. A lot of people don't know I have a wife. And those who know I have a wife still don't know who my wife is. So they're asking, who is SoFlo's wife? Okay, I need you to go over to her channel and hit that subscribe button. She does hair, makeup, fashion, life vlogs, mommy vlogs, sponsored content, product reviews with codes that you can use to shop and get huge discounts and all that. You know, and her channel is probably more for the ladies, but there's something there for everyone. She used to be called Shakira Sphere. I mean, <laughs> she used to be called Brains in a Beat on YouTube, but she changed her name. And after she changed her name, I don't know what happened to her algorithms. Anyhow, here she is. Hit that subscribe button. When you go to her channel, tell her your man sent me over here and vibe to her content.